Well, hello everybody. How y'all doing? I'm doing all right. I wanted to share how I have lost 13 pounds in five weeks. Um, now please consult your doctor before you try anything, do anything, make any changes. I'm not a doctor. This is just my personal experience. And I also understand that losing 13 pounds in five weeks, a lot of that is water weight. However, that's water weight off my body. And also it shows that by doing this one thing, I decreased a lot of inflammation that was in my body. So I got to 320 as my high weight. Um, and then through various diets, including keto, I got down to 204.6 at the beginning of 2023. But I also got COVID, influenza A, I had gotten shingles four times in the two years, many surgeries, and um, I had a horrible ulcer that I went on medication for and I lost all my hair. My body had been through a lot of trauma and so my weight loss just stopped. It just stopped. It didn't matter what I did. It didn't matter how low calorie I went. It didn't matter how high a calorie I went. It didn't matter how low of carb I went. My body said no. And so I really battled 2023 because I started to gain weight no matter what I did. And on top of getting gastritis and having my ulcers and things like that, um, I did incorporate more carbs. I did keep low calorie, but I, it didn't matter. I gained about 40 pounds back. It was very devastating and it has been very devastating. On top of the fact that I'm 52 and I still haven't started menopause. I know I'm in Perry, but I'm still so regular that, um, yeah, it's very frustrating because my body is haywire. And so um, I am not a, cha a channel that does challenges. I just don't. And I want to eat the way I'm going to eat. You know what I mean? And I don't want to just throw in a challenge and then go back to the way. I, I just don't see the point of that. But I did want to do an experiment because people have been doing this for a long time. And I have always poo-pooed the idea. But... I said, you know what? I am going to cut my dairy to under two ounces a day. That is all I did. I had tracked my calories. I knew how many calories I was having. So even though I went down to two ounces of dairy a day, I compensated with my meat and eggs. I did not decrease calories. I said I was going to increase steps, but I threw out my back and I got bursitis in my hip. So I didn't increase my steps. I am between 10 and 11,000 right now. And during this time, there were many days I only got four to 6,000 steps a day because of my hip and my back. So I didn't, it wasn't through additional exercise either. So um, like I say, I, I understand that a lot of that weight is water weight, but the fact that dairy does that to me, that causes so much inflammation that all I did was decrease the amount I had and my body just flushed 13 pounds out of me. Um, that to me is astounding. I had always said, I'm going to eat dairy, uh, which is interesting because I was a vegan for 12 years and I didn't have a lick of dairy. Um, I was hesitant to give up dairy again because I, it was like a go-to snack. I liked it. I enjoyed it. But um, obviously my body is okay without it. So um, while I am not going to do a challenge, I know Mission Keto is, they are going um, dairy free in August. So I will link their channel and you can follow along with them. I know for me, I, I intend to continue this. It's not a challenge. I intend to continue to stay under two ounces of dairy a day. And um, yeah, eventually I'll, be increasing my steps as I my body heals and I am sure as the weight is slowing down that I'm losing I'll eventually go back to starting to count calories but for right now I I am just astounded and amazed that that's all I had to do that's all I had to do to drop 13 pounds and I know it wasn't just water weight because I did lose a pant side so that that's a good one for me. So that's enough reason. That's enough reason for me to look at that queso fresco and say no. But anyway, I hope you all have a good day. I, again, I will link Mission Keto below. And yeah, so 
if you're looking to drop some weight, maybe, maybe ease off the dairy a little bit. So yeah, there you go. Have a good one. Talk to you later.